When we do any 3D printing, the file type we want to use is a .stl file. Now you could send over a DWG file and the person that's running the 3D printer could convert it, but it's additional work for them because they've got to be able to open the file and go through the steps to do it. Whereas if the person sending it over does it in their workflow, it's only one extra step. The second thing is we have run into cases where someone sends it over a DWG file that has multiple items in that file and the person running a 3D printer doesn't know what to print. So we just want to get the one item. So here's how we convert it. We're looking at a bracket right now. All I'm going to do is go up here, export, other format. The file type I want, it's already selected for me. It's the .stl. Uh, I will go ahead and just save this on my desktop. And we're going to call it bracket. I'm going to hit save. Now it just wants me to select the item that we're going to convert. So I just click on that and we're done. If I go to my desktop now, we can see I've got an STL file from the bracket. So I did it all in my workflow. It wasn't an extra step. I didn't have to open anything new and it only takes a couple seconds. So that's what we want.